already. That guy started it. Oh yeah. Ice bath number what? Five? Like recorded five? Six? I think five or six. Something like that? Yeah. How cold is the water today? 52. Sweet. Wasn't it 49 at some point? Yeah, but the sun. It warmed up a little? It warmed okay. up and the ice melted. It's still not bad. 51.4. Okay, so it's getting colder. Yeah. A little bit. Low 50s is not bad. We're doing a seven minute ice bath. Yeah, seven minutes today. Okay. First question is, what does my phone wallpaper tell you about me? Why can't I think of your phone wallpaper right now? <laughs> is it the cat? No, it's just the basic, whatever comes with the phone. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. Um, <laughs> tells me you just haven't gotten around to it. <laughs> <laughs> you don't care enough to change it right now. But yeah. if you were if you were to change it, it would either be a picture of probably us, me, but most likely Simba. Or one of the cats, but probably Simba. Yeah, be, it would that'd be my guess. Yeah. It would either those would be the two top ones. Yeah. Simba, the our babies and then or you. Yeah. You're doing great. Four minutes to go. Question number two. Do you think I've ever checked an ex's phone for evidence? Yes. I have not. Really? Really. Okay. I'm surprised. Yeah. I'm wrong. I've never had a doubt or question. Yeah. Questioned anything to have checked someone's phone, my ex's phone. Really? Yeah. <laughs> not even Dave's? Not even Dave's. Really? <laughs> You just let it be what it was? I just let it be whatever it was. Okay, that's fair. Does that surprise you? A little bit. A little but bit. I don't know. I mean, that makes sense. I guess I have enough trust in people where I don't feel like I need to unless they give me like a really good reason not to. Sure. Think of your favorite brand of cereal. On the count of three, say your answers out loud. Okay, okay wait. wait. So this is for both Brand of us. Brand of cereal, or can we just name the cereal? I think we just name the cereal. I say we just name the cereal. All right, I'm, I'll count to three, and then we'll both say it. I, I, I'm ready. All right. All right, ready? Yes. One, two, three. Cinnamon Lucky Charms. Crunch. <laughs> <laughs> Lucky yeah. Charms and Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Yeah. I'm surprised you didn't say the Strawberry Special K or whatever. I know you like that one a lot. I do too, but Cinnamon Toast Crunch yummy. was on my mind and I've been yeah. craving it lately. That was, that was the one that came up first too. It, it was, was between that and uh, Lucky Charms. Okay. Yeah, my two top favorites are the Special K Strawberries and the Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Yeah. Those are the ones I find myself eating the most. Yeah, they're yummy. When I do. The healthy and the unhealthy. I don't even know if Special K is that healthy. I have no idea. Well, I don't know how healthy it, it is. It seems healthy because there's strawberries in it. Yeah. <laughs> I guess like either two, the strawberry K's are the healthier option. Yeah. It's been a long time since I put bananas in cereal, but I like bananas in cereal. I used to um, put uh, blueberries and strawberries in my cereal all the time. Uh, I don't think I've ever had blueberries in there. So good. I wouldn't. I'd try it now, but it was too weird when I was younger little whatever. It was a picky kid. Got a minute and a half. Yeah. You're doing great. How do you feel? It's cold. <laughs> but good. Alright. Got time for another question. <laughs> Alright, wild card. Rate your dancing skills on a scale of one to ten. On the count of three we say our answers out loud. So it's a both players thing. Oh god. Um, I'm not really much of a dancer. Me neither, but I'm ready. <sighs> On a scale of 1 to 10? Yeah, don't you gotta count to 3 and then we say it? Yeah, I know. Like I'm thinking. Okay. I'm ready whenever <laughs> right. you are. You count down. 3, 2, 1. 10. <laughs> you didn't say your number. <laughs> <laughs> you just counted down. What's your number? Okay, so wait, on a scale of 
of one to ten, so ten being like the best dancing skills. Yeah. One being, okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Mine's a five. <laughs> you counted down, and then we were supposed to say it at the okay, same time. We it's do. Too late, we do. It's too late now. Well, I say ten in terms of funny, because I'm definitely not a good dancer. If I was actually rating it as a, if I'm a good dancer or not, it's a zero. But fair. In, in funny, I think it's a ten. Fair. Yeah. And that's the timer. Yay. All right. Hell yeah. Hand is up now. Yep. You have to give the camera two thumbs up or one thumbs up for how you feel. I feel eight thumbs up. <laughs> The one time I jumped in there and I forgot to set the timer, I so I had too. to hop out and restart it. Yeah, I did that too before. It's like, oops, retake. Mm -hmm. All right, here we go. One, two, three, go, yay. Right. And I'll start it when your butt hits the floor. <laughs> butt hits the floor. Oh, yep. God. There we go. Woo. Nice. What do you think I'm most likely to splurge on? Most likely to splurge on? Uh, some sort of candy. What's my good candy? Reese's Pieces? Nerds? Sure. I would definitely say candy for sure. It is a splurge, yeah. I feel like it means like or, what I spend a lot of money on. Or or I would say disc golf uh, discs. Like discs. Yeah, that's what I would say. I would say I would say if we're going for that right. discs. If you that's... if you could you would spend as much money as possible on discs. Or disc golf stuff. Or yeah. disc golf stuff. Yeah, for sure. How likely am I to go camping? How high maintenance is my setup? <laughs> How likely would you go? Have you ever been camping? Are you I don't. Serious? I don't think you. Ha no, you have not been. Wait, I don't. I don't. Are you <laughs> yes. serious? I don't know how many times I've gone camping for disc golf tournaments. Oh. I don't know God. how many times you and I have gone camping for disc golf tournaments. I guess I'm thinking like outside of, I guess, thinking outside of disc golf, like going up north and just for the weekends for just a moment camping, and camping. camping. Yeah. I mean, I guess, but yeah, I definitely, I would consider camping for disc golf tournaments as camping. I would say that's, I that's, mean, I wouldn't not go camping, but most definitely. of my camping has been because of disc golf disc tournaments. Golf, for and sure. you and I have gone camping a bunch of times. Jake and I have gone camping a bunch of times. Jared and I have gone camping. We got kicked out because we thought the campsite was free and we stayed there all That's weekend. Right. And then the third day, there was someone parked there. We got a note on our tent saying, you're banned and we have your license plate numbers and so on and so forth. So I, we haven't been back there, of course, obviously. Yeah, but now that, that you was, say that. I have that. no idea why we thought it was free. And then we apologized to the people that were there. They, they were really cool about it. That's right. And there was another trip that we went on for disc golf that we camped in someone's uh, lot. Uh, Forget who it was. I think that was maybe the time that Reed came along with us. Was the, are you talking about the time when we at, or camped at Flip City? Maybe it was Flip City. When we were in your car? Yes. Yeah, that was yeah. one of them for sure. Cheap camping. <laughs> I mean... Technically. Kinda. I mean, kinda. we just used your Jeep as the setup. It worked out pretty well. But yeah, how likely would you go camping? I'd say you would go camping pretty often if you got the chance to. Yeah. Alright. Got time for one more. You have right. 30 seconds left. Already? Yeah. That went by fast. What subject do you think I thrived in at school and did I fail any? Um, what subject did you thrive in? Yeah. I mean, you're not wrong, but like, I guess what kind of science is like, I don't know, like, I thrived in astrology. astronomy. Yeah, astronomy I did really well in. Science was kind of all, I was all over the place. 
I, I was, was all over the place with everything, obviously. Like, honestly, I, I was very middle of the pack with everything, just more or less. I didn't care because I kept moving everywhere. Well, yeah, you're bounced around. Yeah. So, oh, like, I mean, like, even like my senior year of school, I was in fucking geometry because I was always, like, too far behind, so I'd always have to be held back. Yeah. Otherwise, I'd, there was so much to catch up on. But I would say astrology for sure. Astronomy. Astronomy, astronomy yeah. yeah. That yeah. what I said the first time, yeah. Yeah, that, that was the one I took my senior year. Like, I don't know. I, I've always enjoyed science, but that was the one I did the best at. And then math I was pretty decent at, but I never got the chance to, like, go further into it or whatever. And then English I sucked at. Um... Because I didn't care that much about it. What do you History, think mine I, were? Um, that I thrived in, uh, didn't do so well in. I'd say you're probably the same as me. I think you probably didn't like English and stuff that much. And English was definitely my weakest because of yeah. the comprehension. Yeah. And just, like, it wasn't something that I was, like... You probably didn't like history that much either at the time. Like, You're I didn't right. like history at all. I thought it was stupid when I, I was a kid. I love history now. Really? Yeah, I yeah. like history a lot now. Like, I'm the total opposite now than I was in school when it came to, like, subjects and stuff like that. Like, I know, like, my biggest strength was, uh, subject was math. Was it? I loved math. Any yeah. type of math. Yeah. Um, what was the highest math you did? Did you get up to like calculus? Didn't do calculus. I think it was in between geometry and calculus. So trigonometry? Trigonometry, yeah. Okay. I never did trigonometry. Uh, and science, I never really took science classes because all of my science credits were medical classes. Oh, that's right. And so my science credit, or. So I mean, that's science. But yeah. Just not, but it was, not uh, like what you think, like not physics or biology or No, whatever. I did do biology my first year of. Uh, high school mm -hmm. and then my last two I traveled to Stevenson and my two credits were towards medical medical uh, and right. dental mm -hmm. and then I was big into track I did track all of yeah. junior and yeah. part I, of my I like gym a lot senior too. I think like a lot of kids did yeah gym oh my god put me and Lauren and your me and Lauren were in gym together uh -huh. and we didn't take it serious we just fooled yeah. around the whole time. I think that's what a we lot hung of out in the do. locker room a lot of times. Sure, is that where all the pictures came from? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. We were sitting on top of the lockers and just chilling yeah. and just having a good old time. Uh huh. But yeah, but I would say definitely your strongest suit was astrology. Strong, Oh my god, I can't pronounce space stuff. Yeah, space, space stuff. stuff. All right, good job. You did like an extra minute. Extra and a half, minute. Right? <laughs> Alright, go do a nice bath, everyone. Two thumbs up. Triple, triple thumbs up. <laughs> triple thumbs up.